Good morning, everybody. My bike is currently tipped over because it can't stand up straight. Looks like I didn't quite put this thing on right because it's able to slide. This is gonna be the first real test of our modifications to the bike. So I'll let you guys know how this goes. Oh my God, are you fucking kidding me? My mirror broke. I might be able to fix this with zip ties actually. Zip ties are so useful to have. This is likely not a permanent fix. So we should look at stopping at a bike shop soon. Zip ties for the win. Okay, let's go. It might get cold. I think I'm gonna put my jacket on actually. It looks like I didn't fix my brakes properly. Listen to this. Oh, it was just squeaking a lot earlier. Yeah, see, it's squeaking again. We'll fix that later. Ah, oh, God damn it. I don't want to go down the stupid dirt road. Hey, look at that. We get a big boy road. Never mind. We're on shitty roads again. Okay, I think I found the first problem with my little contraption that we built yesterday. As we go over the bumps in the road, the backpack likes shifting forward, which means as I'm moving my feet and I'm pedaling, my heel keeps hitting this. I need something to keep this back more. I think for the time being, I will use this as like a, like a wall. And then later on, I'll stick like a big screw up right here so that nothing can go that way. You see all that water right there? We're gonna go very slowly. We're gonna be very careful. I'm not crashing again. The speed limit here is like 70 miles an hour. Fuck me. Okay, I think one of my brakes finally failed. Look at this, I'm grabbing this completely and I'm still able to move backward and forward. I think they failed. I just need to get somewhere safe to work on it. Okay, I found a little gas station. In the wrong Imagine if this happened up in the mountains. Okay, let's take a look at this guy. I think we're gonna take the whole caliper off to inspect it. Don't fall over, Jesus. Nothing looks like it's broken. Everything's working like it should. I don't know why it wasn't able to grip. Swear to fucking God. Ah, oh, God. The fucking kickstand, when it came up, it's... Mm, I think this should do it. Good, look at that. It stops things. I think the brake is fixed. I can't tell you why it stopped working to begin with, but I think it's fixed now. God fucking damn it. I'm gonna fucking lose my shit. Okay, I think I'm, see, uh, the brake is definitely still not working. If this bike falls over one more time, I'm gonna lose my fucking shit. Okay, after adjusting the lever, I think it's working now. You gotta twist this thing to get the length exactly right. My brake works. While we're here, let's go ahead and get something to eat. Uh, the selection is smaller than I thought it would be. Oh, they do actually have Coke. Uh, oh, we'll do coffee. We'll do coffee, cappuccino. Apparently they take cards here. I'm pretty sure we still have waffles left over. We can eat those. Yeah, look at that waffle. They're kind of smushed now because my bike keeps falling over. We've also got an oats and fruit energy bar. Oh, this definitely melted at some point. It's banana flavored. Mm. Iced coffee, here we go. pretty good. Okay, I think that we're ready to hit the road again. My leg is killing me from when that kickstand, uh, when my bike fell over my kickstand fucking, I don't even know how to describe it, scraped my leg. Fucking, I'm really glad I'm wearing jeans because I'm pretty sure I'd be bleeding right now if I wasn't. I might be bleeding, I don't know. However much damage the bike did to me when it was falling over, the damage would be worse if I wasn't wearing jeans. Ah, fuck, my leg really fucking hurts. 150 feet. 
It's trying to send me down this road, but it looks like there's a bunch of construction. Yeah, uh, this road is impassable. They've literally torn the asphalt up, so we need to reroute. Luckily for us, I do see an alternative route. I can tell that people take their cows and their horses or whatever animals they have through here because there's a whole bunch of just like crap on the road. Hey, speak of the devil or speak of the cows. Uh, the dog is running away. I don't want to deal with that. Do you guys remember that energy drink that I said was like the national energy drink of Kosovo? Um, I think I found where they make it. Yeah, I have no idea what this place is. That's a building, it's got windows, there's a little dog running around. And there's a whole bunch of these industrial containers. Yeah, these barrels are definitely made in the construction of the energy drink. What a strange place. Whatever that company is doing here, they're definitely litter bugs. Let me check these guys. Oh, yeah, so I, I should put like some piece of foam or rubber in between these two so they're not bumping into each other and making noise. We don't like noise. That is what we would call a future Nate problem. We've got 20% battery left. I'm gonna start looking for a cafe. I found a restaurant. Let's see if they have outlets. Yes, they have an outlet, good. Don't fall over, Jesus Christ. I already ordered a cappuccino. Apparently they sell hamburgers here, so we're gonna try that. Yep, okay. okay. Yes, you'll show me? Cool. We're using Google Translate to order. Google Translate is not that great. People keep asking me why I don't just use Google Translate to talk to the locals. It's really slow and it's not that accurate. It's, it takes like a solid 15 minutes to actually have a conversation with somebody. It took us like seven minutes for him to explain to me that they don't sell food until an hour later from now. Fantastic, thank you so much. So I'm looking at the website of the company that made my bike and I noticed they have an upgraded version now and it's got, it fixed a lot of the problems that I'm currently having with my bike. Like the battery is inside the frame rather than inside the back right here. Um, I think I'm gonna reach out and see if they wanna, you know, send me another one. Okay, it looks like the bike battery is done charging. We can head out. Okay, let's hit the road again. Hey, wait a minute, I've been here before. We got orange juice last time we were here. Oh shit, the cashier is really cute, I remember that. Ah, uh, we need to go though, it's not important. I think these hills are too much for it. We are on paved asphalt and it is struggling. Or, when I worked on my brakes this morning, I made them too tight, and now my brakes have basically been on for this entire time. Yeah, it's not doing anything. I am on full throttle, and it is just not moving. Turning the bike off and back on did seem to reset it. It's moving itself now. So we're just gonna pull off the road into the shade right here while I look at the brakes. Yeah, the poor bike is struggling. We need to go up there. Okay, I gave her a break. Let's see if she's ready to do it. I think I just had to let the controller cool down. I'm sure it was getting real hot with all of the amperage going through it. Go bike, go bike, go bike, go, come on. Okay, time for a break. Gonna let the controller cool down. I am the controller. Dude, look at how high we just climbed. Oh no, oh yeah, no, I do still have a Diet Coke in my bag. Good. I also have an apple strudel protein bar. How melted do you guys think it is? Pretty, pretty melted? Yeah, we'll, we'll not, we'll wait for later for that. Let's get the pretzels. Okay, let's go for the next leg up the mountain. We still have a bunch more to climb.
This bike did all that. Okay, well, I definitely helped. Finally, we get a stretch of downhill. Looks like it's short-lived though. Oh, thank God, it does not want me to go up there. For the first time ever, we're not taking the sketchy dirt roads. You know, I've noticed that there are a lot of Albanian flags flying in Kosovo. Like just a lot of Albanian flags. We are so fucking high up, holy shit. I did not realize how much elevation we gained. We are going downhill really fast. Going very, very slowly. See, imagine if my brakes failed here, going down that hill. We would be going very fast, very quickly. Like, I don't know why they didn't extend the guardrail further. We're actually just waiting for my rotors to cool down because I don't want them warping. Okay, the rotors have had a chance to cool down. I think we are off the super steep part of the mountain. I think I found a puppy. Oh, pup, it's okay. Come here. Oh yeah, no, oh. I can feed you. Damn dog. Another dog though. Come here, pup. None of these dogs like people. Looks like we're back to being dirt road gang. Somebody just dropped a bunch of bricks in the middle of the road. Bad people. Luckily, that dirt road was pretty short. I still remember that one time in Hungary that we spent like 20 miles going through farm back roads. God, look at this shit. Do you see this shit right here? No? Is that because it's really fucking hard to see? Yeah, Kosovo is channeling its inner Albania. Paint your fucking speed bumps. I found some pups. Let's go get the dog food. Hi, puppy. Oh, no, it's okay. Come here. Come here. I've got food for you. Yeah. Here. No, it's okay. Oh, oops. I didn't mean to hit you. But yeah, there you go. You can eat it. It just ran away too. Why are all of these dogs so scared of people? It makes me think that the locals are not very nice to stray dogs. And that makes me sad. Follow this way for 900 feet. Oh my God, do you guys see that right there? See how hard that is? Look at this. Look at this, do you guys see that? Fucking paint your, mm. I'm gonna break my bike. Bikes need to go much slower than cars do. I could go the same speed as a car and it would fuck up my bike, but the car would be fine. Like bikes need to know there's a speed, there's another fucking speed bump. You have no fucking clue it's there. These two kids just recognized me at the playground. I honestly don't know how people recognize me so easily. Like I don't, I don't stand out in any particular way. I'm just a white dude. It wants me to go down this torn up road. Um, let's see if we can go around without actually going on the torn up asphalt. Nope. We get to ride on the asphaltless path. Like there's literally a main road right there. Why didn't it send me down that one? Oh my God, This uh, it meets up with the main road. I could have just gone on the main road back there, but it put me on this, mm. then turn right. Yeah, I should have just gone on the main road from the start. Go this way for 1.19 miles. Notice how there's no big rocks on this road. It's trying to send me off on another dirt road and I don't trust it, but we're going. Because I'm a bitch and I do what I'm told. Oh my God, you guys are never gonna believe this. No, move, move puppies. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, hello. These aren't running from me. Oh, I wanna steal one. Oh, there's another one coming. Oh, hello. You guys are so dirty. Oh, I'm gonna get fleas, aren't I? Ooh, yes. That's not food. Oh, I don't want to leave them. I want to steal one. I'm not sure where I would keep it. They're following me. I think I need to say goodbye. Come here. Come on. Yes, come here. Boop. Boop. I want to make sure that they've got some kind of food or water. Okay, so they have water. So that means somebody is sort of taking care of them. I hope there's not mosquitoes in here. No, it looks fresh water. There's more puppies in the grass over there. I'm not sure where the mom is. 
Okay, well, I think if anybody needs vitamins, it's probably these puppies. So I'm gonna get these vitamins in a really small little pieces and see if I can feed each one individually. Don't fall over, you motherfucker. Okay, we're gonna take one of the kibbles and we're gonna break it. I'm gonna take one small little piece of it and I'm gonna feed it to a puppy. You get this, yes. Yeah, they seem entirely uninterested in the vitamin. Pop, right here. Pop. God, they almost knocked my bike over and they spilled all of the vitamins. No, dogs, no, stop, this is bad for pups. You can't have this much. Fucking dogs, go away, stop. This will be, I, I'm not even sure if they can fit this in their mouth, actually. Oh, they're trying. Fucking, no, bad, drop. Drop the fucking vitamins. You guys, these will make you sick. You can't have that much. I found a way to get them to clean up the crumbs. It's like a doggy vacuum cleaner. Regretfully, I think that we need to say goodbye to the pups. I hope they don't get run over. They're kind of in the middle of the road. I am feeling some bananas and some Coke Zero. Perfect. Let's get a big one and a can. Big one and a can. We'll also come over here and get some of this orange juice. Hello. Perfect. Thank you very much. Have a good day. <laughs> now we get to make like the puppies and eat. I guess the puppies didn't eat very well actually in hindsight. Like licking dust off a strange man's hand is not exactly what I would call a meal. We have uh, about 40% battery left, so we should probably find a place to stop and eat dinner because we can charge up a battery while we're there. Yeah, I have eaten a buttload of bananas on this trip. There's a tunnel coming up. There's a red light out here in the middle of no, oh, there might be construction. Yep, it's because of construction. Hey, I found a restaurant that we can probably eat in. Oh. Uh. Okay, this is called Alba and it has the Albanian I think it's Albanian and the English, so I can definitely read this. That's good. GPS signal is weak. Your recording will continue, but your position Shut up. may not be accurate. They have something here called American macaroni. I'm kind of curious what that is. I'm from America, so I'm just curious what this American macaroni is. Can I get one of those? American, American macaroni, yes. We are in Kosovo, and so we could have like Kosovo food, or we could see what they think American food tastes like, and that sounds so much more interesting to me. You know, the more we do this, the more I realize that the solar panel was just a really stupid idea because literally everywhere we go to eat has outlets. Electricity is not rare. This restaurant also has blazing fast internet. And thank you so much, yes, perfect. So as an American, I can say with a good degree of confidence that this is not how we have macaroni and cheese. I'm not, I haven't tried it yet, I'm not sure if this is bad, but this is definitely not how we eat it. Yeah, this doesn't even taste like macaroni and cheese. This is like pasta. This is like traditional Italian pasta. So this is gonna sound not very grateful. I got two meals. I got the American macaroni and I got some just plain spaghetti. Neither of them are very good. It's because of things like this that I keep just going for bananas. Like I know that I will like them every time. I am ready to pay. I pay and he's just like, where are you from? I'm like, oh, America. He's like, oh, American. I love America. Thank you so much. I'm like, I didn't do anything, but you're welcome. I want to steal more electricity, so we'll just let that sit there for a sec. I want to show you guys outside. Hmm. We get to go camping somewhere out here. I'm pretty sure there's oil somewhere over here because all of this infrastructure, like this entire restaurant and hotel is made just for the construction crew with all of these people. Like this entire thing is just built for mining oil. And I'm assuming it's oil because it's called Alba Oil Group. Sorry, uh, squeeze around you. Nothing. Thank you. So 
So now we just need to find out where we want to camp. This place is very much industrialized. You know, I just realized I have still never slept on that inflatable sleeping mat. I didn't get the chance to at the campsite. Oh, we are almost at the border of Macedonia, actually. This will be this will be a last day in Kosovo. I'm not sure if Kosovo allows wild camping, so we need to be a little bit more cautious and hide from people tonight. I didn't want to, but I think we're about to cross the border. Okay, I'm gonna walk my bike in and show you guys that even if I walk it, they're still gonna think it's a motorcycle. Thank you. Am, am I good? Oh, thank you. Yeah, Macedonia does not care. Welcome to Macedonia! Yeah. Oh, it looks like there is another border control. Well, that's confusing. It does not look like there is one that I can just walk through. So it seems that last one was just the exit stamp. And now we get to find out if Macedonia cares if this is a motorcycle or not. Hello. Hello. Am I good? Thank you. Cool. This time for real. Welcome to Macedonia. Goddamn. Yeah, they also didn't care. It's only Kosovo. Kosovo is the only place that confuses this with a fucking motorcycle. Get your shit together, Kosovo. This is a very busy road and it's getting dark. Not good. These people's fucking headlights are blinding. We don't have a lot of daylight left to be able to set up a tent. We need to find a place to camp really quickly. I'm just hunting for a spot. Or like a little side road that I can go down. This is definitely not public land. I have no idea if I'll get in trouble for camping here. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go way off into the corner so that if people do come here early in the morning, at the very least, I won't be like in their way. I guess this is as good a spot to camp as any. I can use the light from my bike to set up the tent. Yeah, I legitimately have no idea if I'm allowed to camp here. None at all. So we will be as quick and light as, stay up you motherfucking bike. We will be as quick and light as possible, only getting the sleeping bag, the tent, and the mattress. We're not using any stakes, we're not using the tarp underneath. We are going as bare bones as possible to get this up and out as fast as possible. The tent will look weird and strange without the pegs in the ground, but it doesn't need to look good. It just needs to keep bugs out. Throw the sleeping bag in, inflatable bed, and inflatable pillow. Okay, I think that I'm gonna call it a night. I'm gonna turn this bike light off so that we're less likely to get seen. Um, I'll let you guys know how this works tomorrow. Um, yeah. Oh shit, let me make sure I still have cell data. Otherwise I can't upload this. Testing. It's not great, but I do, we're good.